Today's program is all about health and environment. Let's kick off with the Eco Clean Air Initiative, where the State Environmental Protection Agency took the campaign to Ibirche, or Jo Era of Lagos, to create awareness on air pollution. Pollution is an environmental health hazard that individuals get exposed to on a daily basis. It's caused by emissions from vehicles, fumes from waste, electricity generators, among others. According to the World Health Organization, every year, air and many other forms of pollution are responsible for millions of deaths around the world. In Lagos State, Southwest Nigeria, the campaign against air and water pollution is one that the state government is not taking lightly. The State Environmental Protection Agency is visiting communities to educate residents on the dangers of pollution. Itedo community is the first to receive the Eco Clean Air Initiative. From there, Lasepa officials moved to Falamo 5 Cowries Terminal to take a boat ride to Ibishi to enlighten those in the River Rhine areas on healthy living and the Clean Air Initiative. The people were informed about the benefits of waste sorting and also to stop the habit of littering the beach. The intention of government with this program is to encourage um, um, our people to be able to be environmentally conscious and uh, to avoid air pollution because uh, we know that uh, pollution is not, um, is not friendly to us. So we are trying to teach the Goshians how to manage their environment, uh, to stop uh, burning of trees, uh, burning of refuses, uh, burning of plastics, to recycle their plastic very well, and also to use um, gas in replacement for, for firewood. We've been to a community uh, about a week ago uh, in uh, Ibeguleki area, and this is the second place that we are, that we are coming to. Uh, we are going to take this to all the 57 LCDs in Lagos for education and awareness of our people. The general manager of Lesepa says the rise of the sea level is of great concern to the government and the people living within the coastal area must be informed about how to protect the ecosystem. We chose a coastal line deliberately because we're constantly faced with rising sea levels. And this is a, a, a trend that is alarming worldwide. And to, to curb this, we have to start to pay attention to global warming and climate change. And how do we explain this to the people that live around the coast? We have brought different types of information, education and communication tools, including drama, including incentivizing. So for example, we have a program called Cash for Trash, where we say pick up your plastic bottles, don't let them go into the oceans, protect the ecosystem in the oceans, because the microplastics, when the fishes eat them, we eat them, and it causes all sorts of diseases, cancer, heart disease, blood disease, even sudden death, because plastic is non-biodegradable. You know, they are getting a new mindset as to their knowledge and their attitude and their practice towards waste management. We are here with four different or five different agencies. We have Lagos State Waste Management Agency. We have Lagos State Waterways Authority. We have Lag Ferry and we have the Health Insurance Management Agency. Why have we brought the Health Management Insurance Agency? The other thing is we are preaching that cash is trash. Cash can be gotten for trash. Trash can be converted to cash. And this time, we are not only converting your trash, we are encouraging recycling by saying that all the waste, don't burn them. Even vegetable waste can be used for fertilizers. Plastic waste especially can be used for recycling. It's also another opportunity for the people to register 
under the state health insurance scheme called Ilira Eko. We are collecting plastic waste, giving incentives, including money. And the high point of today is we are partnering with the Lagos State Health Manage Insurance um, Health Management Agency by giving health insurance. If you bring me 30 plastic bags filled with empty water bottles, pet bottles, you and a family of four are entitled to free health care for a year in any hospital registered under the lash mask scheme. And that is not all. Mr. Babajide Somolo has also created a pocket for the vulnerable group. Those are the ones we call poor and cannot afford health care. If you fall into that group today, right here, because of this program, you'll be enlisted and you have free health care. Because honestly, health is wealth. And we have merged environment and health together so they start to understand the impact of the way they treat their environment on how it affects their health. We thank Lagos State for all the things that they have done, like actually coming up with um, something like this for us to educate us on how to make use of waste in order not to litter our environment and also to be free from what um, all these air pollutions that actually um, we get from what burning some plastics and stuff like that. So I want to say a very big thank you to like the Lagos State Government and also La Sepa and other agencies that are also present here. Like the health um, section, uh -uh, I'm delighted that we can uh, go to hospital now, maybe for at least a year without payment. Uh -uh, it's something. The Lagos State Government says the Eco Clean Air Initiative will be taken to all 57 local council development areas of the state. Yes.